Hello, and welcome to How They Doing, where we ask the question about political candidates, how they doing? Today, we have a special report on one of the candidates in the Republican Party. As second in the polls and current Texas senator, Ted Cruz stands in the shadow of Donald Trump, but has a wide variety of bizarre truthful claims. One of the first things claimed by Cruz is that Ukraine gave up its nuclear weapons when America came in. After extensive research, it has come about that this is when Russia was in control of Ukraine and had their bombs on Ukraine soil. So after it was found that the bombs were in the hands of Russia, we rated this claim as false. Another claim by Cruz is that Obamacare is the worst job killer in America and that millions of citizens lost their jobs because of it. Well, it turns out that Cruz's blow to the Democrats was for nothing because multiple sources have stated that there is no factual evidence supporting these claims. So because of this, we're reading this claim as liar, liar, pants on fire. With a claim by his Republican rival, Donald Trump stated that Cruz has a double passport with Canada and is not eligible to run for president. But after researching with multiple news outlets, we have uncovered a document which proves Cruz, Cruz's renunciation of Canada. After finding this government document, it should some come to no surprise that this claim is false. With another claim on employment, Cruz stated that we have the highest percentage of unemployment since 1977. While this claim seems bold as well as out of proportion, it is indeed true that we have the highest unemployment percentage in 39 years. While this is definitely true, there is little the president can do dramatically to change this rate. With another claim from presidential frontrunner Donald Trump, he stated that there was a Cruz advertisement that circulated which involved his wife in an insulting manner. While most of these things that came out of Trump's mouth are false, this claim is not much different. Sources from Cruz's camp have said that there is no such thing and we have looked and the video is not circulating on any websites. So it's not much of a surprise, this claim is definitely false. And with another contestant for presidency, Hillary Clinton stated that while Trump was a part of the Senate, he tried to ban contraceptives on five separate occasions. But, as, but not as much as of a shocker. This is just an overly broad Democratic charge. This is because as you read the fine print of her official statement, some of the occasions were shut down before they started, so five is highly exaggerated. So this rates Hillary's statement towards Cruz as false. While no politician is perfect, a lot can be said about the statements Ted Cruz has stated on his campaign trail. One that can be is not that they're all, all are perfect, as seen on the pie chart, but they're all working towards being the commander-in-chief. Good night, America.